Welcome back to Wine on the Craft. My name is Johanna and I am so excited today. I have a huge haul to share. Some things I'll show you and some things I'll tell you about because they're not that exciting, but this is my receipt. Yep, lots of stuff. So I can tell you we are stocked on all our snacks. We got my dog got five bags of his favorite treat. That's a sweet potato wrap with chicken. He loves those. That's already in his little box. My kids are happy for our uh, movie nights because I've got uh, the theater box candy. I got two Whoppers, two Raisinets, two M&Ms. Uh, I got stacked cheddar. Uh, the the stacks containers that are so popular and the kids love for a dollar. They're like a dollar fifty something at Walmart. Um, I got the peach old orchard iced tea. Um, so we're doing good there. I got the true lemon boxes for my water every day. I got Cascade uh, dishwashing packets. I got the um, Dollar Tree brand that I can't remember the brand right now. I don't see it here, but I got those dishwasher packets as well. I got the Wise Cheese Puff Doodles, um, potato chips, the salt and vinegar potato chips. Well, you can imagine, uh, we just got all sorts of goodies. So for our once a week movie night with my adult children and my daughter-in-law, we are set. And I mean very set. Um, so, you know, those food items, that was exciting. But I've got a lot of other ex uh, exciting stuff. I still have some practical stuff like for my craft rooms, some paper towels, uh, tissues also for my craft room these Scotties are great there are 160 of them and I love 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 the hot pink that matches my craft room accent colors so I got two of those and a little bit more practical I got a shower curtain liner that we use and it's got the magnets at the bottom why pay six seven dollars for one of these when you can just get these i don't know about you but i throw these out when they get stinky because you can scrub them to death and eventually they will get stinky no matter how much you know uh tie likes you put on them to get all that mold off they eventually do get stinky no matter what so i just throw them out and get a new one and for a dollar can't beat it got two drawstring uh, tall bags with a fresh scent love these and this is there's eight in a box and this is great for my uh, craft room trash bag uh, trash can I got more lubricating eye drops I have a severe dry eye and I use restasis but then during the day between the two doses of Restasis morning and night, I use these to refresh my eyes. I got my husband a pair of performance socks. He's got them on. He's testing them. For me, I got these periwinkle and the little, I guess, purple. I'm not quite sure what color this is with like a hot pinky. But... They are so comfortable, and for work that I'm standing all day, these are really, really comfy. And then these I got just because they're cute. It's purple. Purple is my favorite color. You get a solid purple and a white with purple heel and toe. So I got that. All right, enough of that. Let's go to some cool stuff. I got some fun cosmetics because I'm going to do a wet and wild. Uh, oh, this. This is a project. This is a flat frisbee. They call it a flying ring and it's with the summer toys. But I'm going to use this as the basic shape 
for my flip-flop wreath. Uh, why this and not the other shapes that I had gotten for it? Well, because the other shapes do not fit between my back door and the screen door. So I'm hoping that doing it on this flat one, that it'll fit between the door and the screen door. So that's, that's a project. This will be a project as well uh, with the mason jars. I, we don't have the chipboard one, so I grabbed the, uh, I guess this is cardstock, but it's got a lot of different motifs in it. I just wanted the shape of the mason jar. Uh, I don't know what I'm going to do with it, but I'll do something with it. And I'll just play around with that. I want to do a makeup, another makeup video. This I'm going to use to clean my brushes. It, they're facial scrubbies, but they have those little teeth on them that I can very gently rub my uh, brushes on them to get the stuff off. Got another brush. This one is large concealer. I want to do a wet and wild uh, combined with some new LA color stuff that has come out uh, that is very, very cool. So I'm planning on doing that. So I grabbed a whole bunch of stuff. I grabbed some more collagen makeup wipes so that I can have uh, some upstairs for the end of the night when I am going to wash my face for the evening and still and have one down here while I'm doing my makeup. So let's take a look at some stuff. I got an eyelining pencil in black from Wet n Wild. This is LA Color. And supposedly this has a better pigment than if you watched my video of LA Colors uh, full face makeup. It is sorely lacking in pigment. These supposedly have a higher pigment. So I'm going to try that. I've got that color. And I got this color. I love my purples and pinks. So I got those two from LA Colors to try. What else is in here? Also from LA Colors, I got this loose eyeshadow in Sunshine. I love to use these on the inner part of my eye, like right there in the up and down inside by the nose. I also got this color that's a little bit more goldish. This one's called Honeysuckle. And try and see how those are. They're called Intense Shimmer. I got another one of my favorite uh, blush from Colormates. I use this even on a, you know, $35, on top of a $35 uh, foundation. It doesn't matter. It, this stands up right along with all those heavy duty name brands. So I love my mauve color mates blush and I try other brands and I always come back to this. So I got another one. And since it's so good, I got a dark one. This is sun kissed tan. And this dark one I got to maybe use as a bronzer because my essence bronzer sometimes is not as dark as I want it to be, especially now that I'm out and about in the sun and messing with the yard. I'm getting a little darker and my Essence bronzer is not dark enough. I really want to invest in a Physician's Formula Butter, uh, but that too, I've only found the lighter. Uh, the darker is always out of stock when I go hunting, so I'll just keep looking. In the meantime, I'm going to give this a try. Then... Dollar Tree brought in this new brand called the Color Workshop Spring On. So I got these three eyeshadow colors. I got this light peachy pink. I don't know if you can see that clearly. Got the peachy pink. 
I got more like a lilac. And I got this beautiful, and they're shimmery. I got this beautiful bronze. It would be great for the outer corner and glam it up a bit with the shimmer. So we'll see how those work out uh, because I am going to do it on the video. All right, fun, 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 fun. I saw these and I know they're little kids, but I had to have them. Crush Yum Jiggly Pals, they're called. And there's like four different kinds. I only grabbed three because I don't know what it was about the fourth one that didn't really appeal to me. But look at these little guys. They are so, so cute. I just absolutely love them. And if I don't keep them, I know uh, my middle niece is going to love them because she loves little things that are cute. Um, they are squishy, very, very squishy and jiggly, like it says, just absolutely adorable. I love it. So I don't know if you can see all of them clearly, but it's just so cute. I had to have them. And I got these little coin pouches. Well, this one is like a coin. This one, I guess you can put all your cards and little papers and stuff in there and folded money and you don't need a big wallet. And this one for coins, which I think is really cool. That's what I'm going to use it for. And llamas. I love llamas. I wish they were flamingos, but I got my flamingos in something else. Wait till you see. Now look at this. I saw these for the first time in um, Cheap Crafty Girl. And she brought them out, and I fell in love with these things. Look at all of these guys. Look at this. Aren't they amazing? Absolutely amazing. These are eye, eyeglass pouches. Aren't they adorable? Now, they have all sorts of different styles. They have cactus motifs. They have all sorts of different styles. I, of course, focused on pineapples and flamingos because that's my passion. But they had all sorts of colors and styles and motifs on them. They are adorable. And they hang in strips on the eyeglass, um, actually, Maybe not the reading glasses, but the sunglass um, shelf unit. That's where they're hanging, and they are absolutely incredible. And they are uh, like a pleather kind of feel, so they're not that thin fabric that'll de-thread or rip. So I got this flamingo. Now, what can be better for someone like me, then flamingos and pineapples together. Look at that. Look at that. Is that not amazing? I am like totally in love. And of course, a cool looking pineapple, Sun Beach. And on a white background, my beautiful pink flamingos. With the beautiful foliage known in the tropics, standing tall and proud, he's beautiful. And of course, pineapple. And it says, pineapple crush. Look at that. It's beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And for a dollar, this is absolutely incredible. I mean, I, I don't know what to say. And it's got the solid in here, so it doesn't fall open. You have to kind of like, this, you hear that? When it opens. So it 
your stuff won't fall out of there. You can use this for pencils. I plan to use some for pencils um, and a little notepad and my sunglasses, my clip-on sunglasses, maybe even my clip-on readers, uh, just to keep them safe when they're in my purse. So yeah, this is absolutely amazing that they're for a dollar at Dollar Tree. And then the final piece de resistance is the Sunflower Dinnerware has arrived at the South Jersey Dollar Trees. Now, I'm not interested in the whole dinnerware, but my daughter-in-law is a big Sunflower fan, so I got a wine glass, a bowl, and different than the lemon, this has this the pattern on both sides. It's not just on one side. I got a salad plate. And I got a dinner plate. I don't fit. <laughs> and I'm going to do the server plate that we've seen, the tiered plates that we've done many, many times with so many different pieces of either dinnerware or plastic summerware um, that is so fun and yet so functional to do, and it's beautiful. So that's my plan. That's why I got it. Um, it is for her, and I'm sure she'll love it because, again, she loves sunflowers. So if you're interested in them, they're going very fast. Like the lemons in my store, the lemons are gone. There is nothing left. Um, I'm in the Mantua in Gloucester County, South Jersey, uh, Dollar Tree, and we have no lemon left. We did just put this out. We are half done with this. The glass, we have the glasses, water glasses. We have the wine glasses. We have towels. We have pot holders and, of course, the dinnerware pieces. We have coordinating tablecloths. None of them actually have the sunflowers on them, but the colors, solid colors that match. I mean, it's beautiful. It's really, it's a beautiful display right there when you walk in in the middle of the aisle. And I would recommend if you're interested in this dinnerware that you go very quickly. If you're in South Jersey, they are going very fast. Um, every shift I've worked since we put them out, I check out at least out of 10 customers, three or four, I check out six or eight sets. So go for it. It's there. It's waiting for you. Okay. So that's it for me. As you can see, it was incredible. It was a lot of fun. My cart was full. My receipt was long but I'm happy with everything I got. So go out, have fun, and enjoy. It's a beautiful day, at least in South Jersey. Go out and enjoy it and visit us at the Mantra Dollar Tree. You have a good, good rest of your day or night, and I will see you next time. In the meantime, keep your eye on the craft. Bye.